Okay, guys, I really don't even know how to properly introduce this video, so I'm just going to go ahead and skip the introductions here. So there's some serious shit that's going on right now on YouTube that features uh, someone by the name of I Hate Everything. And it isn't so much what I Hate Everything did, it's actually what happened to his channel. So you see right here, I'm on YouTube, just straight up, and let's go ahead and click on I Hate Everything, okay? Let's go ahead. Well, la ti da His account has been suspended due to multiple or severe violations of YouTube's policy against spam, gaming, misleading content, or other terms of service violations. Okay, so how does a channel that makes parodies out of shows and movies and, you know, things like that suddenly get terminated, okay? There are, there are channels and videos that are a hell of a lot worse and uh, definitely uh, more than just PG-13 rated that don't get threatened with this kind of stuff. But his channel, without warning, without nothing, gets taken down. That's bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. And if we go back, if we go back, let's just uh, go ahead and take a look right here. Let's take a look. So he has, as you see right here, he has over 300,000 subscribers. Okay, that's no small feat, okay? That right there takes years upon years of hard work and dedication to get. And all the, all all that's gone. All of it is gone. I, I just, I, I don't understand it. I don't understand it. So let's go ahead and go right here. And I came across this earlier today, which is actually... Uh, what sparked the whole thing as to me making the video. And I do apologize for coming to you shirtless. I wasn't intending on making any more videos uh, tonight after I made the last one, which is actually rendering right now. But this right here is serious. And this right here is honestly just one of the most horrible things that could happen to any YouTuber at all. In fact, it's probably the worst thing that could happen to any YouTuber. I mean... When someone has their whole livelihood dependent on their YouTube account, you know, for making videos, putting their blood, sweat, and tears, and dedication into every single video, and working hard, only for something like this to happen, that's like all their hard work down the drain. So, what I have here is IHE, in other words, I Hate Everything, taken out of my YouTube, uh, made by the man himself. And I'm actually going to go ahead and let the video play. Um... This right here is for educational and for, um, for basically for the purposes of uh, listening to what this gentleman has to say here. So, that being said, sit back and watch the video. Get ready. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Uh, uh. Well, fuck a doodle do. Well, the, the, the next logical step in fucking drama surrounding my channel has come to fruition, I guess. It's been taken down. My channel's been taken down, okay? I don't know particularly why. I have, I've had no, you know, real explanation as to why. I just got a couple of emails from YouTube, one saying that I've gone against community guide guidelines, and another one saying that specifically the, the video where I destroy the Little Panda Fighter, terrible Kung Fu Panda um, rip-off movie video I did um, before Christmas. Um, that was somehow violating terms of use, um, there was nothing in the video that was offensive, or should be offensive to anyone, it was literally me just jokingly, harmlessly, just sort of, you know, playing around with these DVDs of a dumb movie that sucks, you know, no more harmful than prankers that literally harass people, or prankers that literally pretty much show porn, you know, so I, 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 I it's... It's kind of scary this is even... I'm actually going to go ahead and pause this real quick. Sorry for the interruption. But you see that right there? That's a solid-ass point right there. Why is it that uh, YouTubers like I Hate Everything, who make parodies, more or less, gets harassed and have their channel taken down when you have prank channels such as Sam Pepper, for example, who make a living off of putting up these horrendously bad pranks and harassing people, yet his channel's still up. Maybe, maybe, maybe you could explain. Maybe you can explain. You know, I'm kind, of, I'm kind of not sure what the logic is here. If there is any, probably not. You know, I'm thinking that probably a robot did this 
and just decided, oh, well, let's go ahead and, you know, either abuse power or just be all like, oh, well, um, I don't like this guy because A, B, C, D, let's go ahead and suspend his channel, hey? So, let's get back to playing the video. ...able to happen, really. Um, I mean, as you can probably tell, I'm a little bit fucking stressed right now, because <laughs> I don't really know what to do. Um, YouTube is notoriously difficult to, uh, um, contact. So, if you could do me a favor and cause as big of a fucking stink as possible about this, that would be real helpful, thank you. As much support would really be great, because, man, man, just as things start to go well, things are looking up for me. i just gone past, like, 315,000 subscribers. Man, it was so great. Like, a few hours ago, I checked, and everything was a-okay. And now this has happened. Um, which is great. Like, wow. <laughs> All that fucking, all those bloods, all the blood, sweat, and tears that have poured into this, the fucking energy, time, that's years of work. If that's gone, then that's just gone. That's it. That's all fucking gone. Uh, what a lovely thought that is. Just, man, Jesus Christ. What a, mm, love YouTube, love it. Love it. Fuck, like... Let me just get the thing up and just, like, read it to you. We'd like to inform you that due to repeated or severe violations of our community guidelines, your YouTube account, I Hit Everything, has been suspended. Want to give me any more info than that? Instead of just, you know, taking my fucking stuff away? Um, that I'm gonna go ahead and pause right there again. Um, you see, that's, that's another, that's another bad thing about, you know, the way that things are done here on YouTube is they, they give you very little information, okay? They give you very little information as to why such and such happened. And, you know, if, if it's something that is legit, something that, you know, is, could be fixed or whatever, don't you think that maybe you should add a little more detail as to uh, how this person went wrong and maybe it could be fixed? You know, this kind of brings me back. This kind of brings me back to... Um, to what happened with the Jay Wits, who is... Uh, arguably the most popular youtuber on youtube or not popular youtuber po popular poketuber excuse me on youtube um most popular youtuber on youtube is pewdiepie but anyways um he had his lavender town video uh taken down because of community guideline violations and that right there was just it was pretty much the beginning of a long and just in just pretty much I, I can't even think think of the words right now it was it was fucking stupid it was stupid like it was taken down for spam what on earth about that video was about spam but luckily though the issue got rectified and it's uh, back up um, but it just kind of goes to show the uh, amount of holes and flaws in YouTube's flagging systems and you know, you have things that legitimately should be flagged, not taken down, and you have things such as, you know, the Jay Witz's video, and things like this channel right here being flagged and taken down when there was, you know, no reason. No reason at all. So, let's go ahead and play the video out. That'd be nice. We are constantly working to keep YouTube free of spam. Oh, because I'm totally a spam channel, yeah. Yeah, that's all I do. There's no effort or energy or anything poured into it at all. Yada, yada, yada. It says, it's not okay to post a large amount of untargeted, unwanted, or repetitive videos. Are you saying that I'm any of those things? Really? Like, that's very hypocritical, you know? What does that even mean? If you're just gonna target me for that, because some of the shite that's on YouTube, it goes under all three of those things, and if you're just going to target me, then... What? Is this some automated thing? I really don't know who's at fault here, really. Please be aware that you're prohibited from accessing, possessing, or creating any other YouTube accounts. What the fuck? I didn't even get, like, a warning. Like, I got this email the same time as I got the other one. Um, the one about... Your video has been removed from YouTube, yeah. The following... The YouTube community flagged one of your videos. The destroying the little panda fighter video. What the fuck? What a random one to choose. Why that one? Who could I have possibly offended with that? Last time I looked, that video had, you know, like 10,000 likes to like 100 dislikes. Like, who the fuck would be so offended by that? 
What is happening here? What the, what is going on? How is this going against any community guidelines? How am I breaking any rules here? This is a joke. This has to be a fucking joke. Come on, this has to be a joke. I'm so fucked. I'm fucked. Do you understand how fucking screwed I am right now? I don't know what to. I don't know what to do. I really don't. Any support is. It would be great. Because I. I'm just gonna stop. I don't know what else to say. I don't. I'm sorry. I'm just as flustered and confused as you are. Like I just look at my Twitter, and it's just full of filled with this shit. I don't. I don't know. Okay. I'm just gonna end it there. Let's see what happens. Well, okay, so I got I got nothing more to say. I got nothing more to say. He, the way he says pretty much sums up my reaction, how I feel about this. It's absolute bullshit. There's a lot of flaws and a lot of holes in the uh, YouTube uh, flagging community system. Um, I definitely think that uh, things like this should definitely, definitely not go unchallenged. Uh, hence why I'm making this video. Not not so much to, um, not so much to quote unquote get myself more views. If you guys know me for as long as you have, you know I'm a very outspoken kind of person. When I feel that there is an injustice that has been done, um, you know I'm going to speak up about it. And when something like this happens, when someone's YouTube channel, their livelihood gets taken from them, and when there is no Pretty much, pretty much no valid reason behind it. You, you gotta think, what the hell is going on here? What is going on? Okay? Like, this shit should not be happening. Okay? Like, I find that this right here is just... It's, it's one of the most absurd things that could ever happen. I mean, it, it'd, be, it'd be just like... It'd be, okay, it'd be just like this. It'd be like... Uh, you know, say you're, 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 you know, a higher up, say if you're a supervisor or a, a manager of a job, and then you get fired because somebody uh, falsely makes a complaint about you. And I say falsely, okay? Because it's very easy to be able to make a false claim about something or someone to slander and be able to ruin the reputation of not only the object, not only the person, not only the company, but in this case here, the channel. And that right there is not okay. So I'm making this video to more or less draw attention to the fact that this person right here got screwed. I'm also drawing attention to the fact that issues like this are not okay. YouTube, you need to step up your game, okay? I don't know what is going on here. I don't know who made this call. I don't know the kind of people that get hired to manage YouTube. But maybe you might want to look into the hiring process a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Because obviously who did this was not a very smart person. So that's that's all I got to say. That's all I got to say. I'm going to end this video right here. Um, I really don't know what else to say. Share this video. Share this video if you are uh, not okay with this kind of stuff. Share this video if you like I Hate Everything and want to support him. Share this video because this right here is an issue that is not only uh, bad uh, for that person there, but it's bad out of principle because it's showing the kind of corrupt shit that can happen on YouTube and people can get away with it. So I'm going to leave you with that. Have a good day. I'll see you next upload.